hello my dear friends welcome back to my channel so in this video we will discuss how to calculate a cgpa uh, what are the marks you have got in the examination over the year so then after the next stages calculate the cgpa that is cumulative grade point average over the year right so this is the interface of the vtu connect applications which you should use over the year if you are the new student for the vtu so you must know about the VTU Connect application. So you can download it from the Play Store itself, right? So it is the interface of this application. Now you have option here, CGPA calculator, right? You have to just opt this and then you have to go for the new calculation, right? So you have to uh, write down here uh, USN, the USN number over here, whatever the VTU has allotted to you. So I am randomly, I will choose uh, the 2022 scheme USN over here for suppose 4 ub 23 me 0 3 4 right so i'm randomly just choosing the uh, usn number here now you can just get the saved results or uh, suppose you have to opt first the semester first or either if you have a uh, second semester you have to calculate you can semester wise you can calculate this suppose i am taking here the semester second right add subjects now you have to write down the subject names suppose first i will take the mathematics here mathematics second i will just write over here then the maximum marks out of 100 you have to calculate and whatever the marks you have got over there suppose i will take uh, 75 out of 100 i am taking 75 marks and just you have to enter the credits you may already available uh, you may already know about the credits over there what uh, uh, how many credits are there for the particular subject suppose mathematics uh, consists of the credits 4 were there right i am writing 4 so you have to just write down this now you can add up sorry this is mathematics uh, 2 and now you have to add right so it is added successfully now i have to add sub another subject suppose subject 2 is uh, i am taking here for the sake of instance i am uh, taking the c cycle suppose applied chemistry applied chemistry over here right then the maximum marks is 100 and out of 100 i am taking 80 then enter sub subject credit also it contains four uh, credits over there right then i have to add it add it successfully right then uh, next subject i am taking here computer aided engineering drawing uh, this is the subject name you have to write down computer aided engineering drawing right computer aided engineering drawing and then uh, the maximum marks is 100 total i will give it 90 then the subject credit is 3 over here then i have to add it right so i did successfully then add subject uh, suppose fourth subject is i'm taking here professional professional uh, that is writing skills in english writing skills in english over there then enter total marks that is 100 total marks is 100 and uh, i am taking here 85 then credits uh, it contains over one credit over there right then accordingly you have to add up then another subject that is it may be sfh or indian constitution first i will take it indian constitution then 100 marks then 90 subject credit is also one here then i can add up right so next step is the another subject you have to take here that is i will take scientific scientific foundations of health foundations of health over here then marks 100 then accordingly 80 i am taking here then the credits also it, it has one credit so add up then next subject is uh, introduction to electronics and communication so i will take it here introduction introduction to electronics simply i will write introduction to electronics right then the marks i will write here 75 out of 100 then credit is 3 over here so simply add up mm, right then the next subject i will take introduction to internet of things that is iot i can simply write here as short form iot so total marks is 100 uh, sorry 100 then 85 then i can write down the credits for it so also uh, also contains three credits right simply i can add up this particular now these are the subjects one two three four five six seven eight 
so if you just calculate uh, if you just add up these subjects then at the top yeah, it, it will show SGP over the right so in this way you can easily calculate and it is not a hectic process so easily you can calculate SGP or CGP in this particular case with the help of the VTU connect application so I hope this is clear to all people so you should use this particular application for the next semesters also when you go to the next higher semesters you will definitely use this particular application so right now you can just download this particular application right so I will just provide the link in the description box so that you can easily avail this application also thank so thanks for watching my video